Hey, what's up, guys? This is your boy Justin Gaming Boss. I guess. And let, let me put the phone off. And this is my video on why I think Jimmy Butler will contribute really good with the Timberwolves. And my first reason, well, look, there's gonna be a big three if Jimmy Butler joins. There's gonna be. Jimmy Butler, Andrew Wiggins, and Carlos Towns. Jimmy Butler, a defense like Jimmy Butler is defense and he can play. Oh, my bad. And he can play offense too. Andrew Wiggins is good at offense, but his defense isn't really that good. And Carlos Towns is just amazing all around. Great three point shooter. He can go like hard in the paint. He can, he can do all of that and just yeah. And the trade will actually contribute to them because cause the first reason, because Andrew Wiggins isn't really that good with defense, but but since they're going to have Jimmy Butler, like the pressure on Andrew Wiggins to do defense isn't really going to be there. And, and yeah, and then it's going to be on Jimmy Butler. But, and with Carl Anthony Towns, he's just like good overall. Like he's... And the second reason why I think that the trade is really good, Carlton Towns is a really hard working guy. He would always go to the gym with Kevin Garnett to to like work out. And Kevin Garnett said it himself, he will be a future star. He said it himself, he will be a future star. And I actually believe that because there's this video of him working out like every day, every day. He does not like he does not stop working out. <laughs> But there's no one in the NBA that has worked as hard as Jimmy Butler did. Because in the high school, he didn't receive not, like, <sighs> and, bro, he, he went from being homeless to NBA star. No one worked as hard as Jimmy Butler did on his offense. Jimmy Butler's defense was, like, really good, but his offense was terrible. But now, look at him. Look at him. He's, like, so good. <laughs> But yeah, you know. Um, also, like when the Timberwolves had Zach Levine, like they were losing a lot of games by two. But then when Zach Levine got injured and pushed Shabazz Muhammad, they like they overscored the opponent by like twelve or something like that, right? So it was like something about Zach Levine that made the team really bad. So. That that trade was actually pretty smart to get Jimmy Butler, but yeah, you know, it's no one really knows if if, if like they're gonna be a playoff contender or something like that. But these are my these are my opinions. Like again, again, guys, no one really knows. Okay, okay. So really, I could be like wrong or something because the chemistry issue or something because. Jimmy Butler's brand new or something like that. But still, remember guys, I can be wrong. So, you never know. Um, But yeah, guys, I'll end this video right here. Thank you for watching this video and peace out. Oh, oh, and if you didn't watch out the uh, the last two videos, should we still hate Kevin Durant and why D'Angelo Russell will be an all-star? Watch those two and peace on the street, guys.